We're continuing with demonstration question 2-7. We were on transaction number 6. For walk your dog to build the business you need to advertise. Your mother has agreed to let you use her computer, printer and paper so you create a flyer to advertise the services of walk your dog and print up 500 copies. You spend the afternoon delivering the flyers around the neighborhood. Your mother charges you 7 cents per sheet for a total of $35. You check the cash position of walk your dog. $100 which was your initial investment in the business, minus $26.45, poop bags, plus $15, made from Sandra, the next door neighbor, minus $60.95, which of course is the toys you bought, is equal to $27.60. Unfortunately, Walk Your Dog does not have enough money to pay your mother immediately. She agrees that you can owe her until the business has grown and she won't charge you interest. Thanks, Mom. How do we record that transaction into the expanded accounting equation? We're going to move this page down. I'm just going to take a second to write the headings into the top of the chart. All right. What did the business get? The business got the use of the flyers to help generate future revenue. They've been used up, consumed, which is the definition of the element expense. So expenses increase by $35. Remember, we record it as a positive number because it'll flow up into the equation and become a negative number. What did the business give away? The business gave an IOU to your mother. That means that liabilities increase by $35. Does the equal sign still work? And the answer is yes. It doesn't look like it works because it looks like there's two positive numbers on the right hand side of the equal sign and a zero on the left hand side. But remember that expenses flow up into the equation and become negative. So this is really positive 35 minus 35, which is equal to zero. No impact on assets. Let's go to item number seven. A total of 12 customers hire you to walk their dogs. After some research, you discover that the response rate for flyers is as high as 4.4%. So you're actually lucky that only 12 customers signed up. You realize you should have done more research before delivering all those flyers. There is no way you can walk 12 dogs a day. You ask your best friend who lives next door to you to join you in the business and she agrees. Your best friend contributes $100 cash to the business. What did the business get? Cash, which is an asset because it has future economic benefit. Assets increase $100. What did the business give away? Well, the business gave away more of the ownership, a slice of the pie. So owner's capital increases by $100. Equal sign, working perfectly. Item eight, seven customers have their dogs walked once a day for four weeks at $15 per walk. This service is only provided on weekdays. Every day you and your friend collect the cash from your customers. What did the company get? They got cash from their customers and cash has future economic benefit, so it's an asset. But how much do assets increase? We'll have to do the calculation. Seven customers multiplied by five days a week, multiplied by four weeks, multiplied by the $15 per walk is equal to $2,100. The company got $2,100 cash. What did the company give away? They provided a service. Done deal did their jobs. So that is revenue. Revenues increased by $2,100. Item nine, two customers have their dogs walked twice a day for four weeks for $15 per walk. This service is only provided on weekdays. Cash is collected at the end of every day. What did the company get? Again, they got cash with future economic benefit, which is an asset. So cash increases by how much? Do the calculation. Two customers multiplied by five days a week, multiplied by four weeks, multiplied by $15 per walk, multiplied by two walks a day. That's equal to $1,200. So the company got $1,200. What did the company give away? They provided a service, finished their job, done deal, have a right to claim revenue, $1,200. 10. Three customers have their dogs walked once a day followed by playtime for 15 minutes for four weeks at $20 per walk slash playtime. The service is only provided on weekdays. Again, cash is collected at the end of every day. What did the business get? They got cash from the customers, which is an asset because it has future economic benefit. I'm going to page down for a second so we can do the math. Three customers, five days a week, four weeks, $20 a day. 
the company got another $1,200 cash. What did the company give away? Again, provided a service, have a right to claim revenue, $1,200. We'll continue with this demonstration problem in the next video. Thanks for watching.